on earth is that been happening? I have no idea. I've been trying to unravel it for the last 10 minutes. Um... But as the end of the day draws near, it looks like it's Phil's trench that's turned up the most intriguing find so far. Has that been worn by a rope? Round the well, top. No, I don't it's think so. Is it a very weathered piece of a statue? Is that an arm going? Ah, on? well, oh, there no. you go, you see. I mean, it does make, it does make you look. wonder whether that is some sort of an arm down there, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it you got something look nice? like an arm. Well, we're looking, we've got a nice yes. piece of what appears to be possibly a bit of carved stone. This? Well, yeah, but what you can't see, Tony, is that round here, yeah. it does look like an arm. It really does. I wouldn't mind. If it's Roman and it's carved stone, that would be a big one for us, wouldn't it? Yep. You were the one who was saying, oh, it's very rare to find things like this. It is this. very <laughs> rare. But we have our occasional moments. Yeah. Don't you wish at a moment like this we were 19th century antiquarians? We could just tip it out. We'd actually find out what it is. What, rip it out <laughs> yeah. without bothering about uh, well, the archaeology? <laughs> can I point out that, thankfully, we are not 19th century archaeologists. We are responsible 21st century archaeologists. We want to do this properly. Have you got no sense of tradition? Basically, Phil's telling us to clear off and come back when he's ready to lift this piece of stone and, crucially, when we'll be able to see the other side of what he's uncovered here. But if uncovering posh buildings and heavy industry wasn't enough for this site, we could be finishing day two with that rarest of discoveries, a finely sculpted Roman statue. Wait. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, no, 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 let's have a look. There's this thing here. It just seems very, very mm. strange. And then there's this as well. That that just doesn't seem totally natural. Mm. Could that just be weathering? I think it probably could. That's yeah. the problem, isn't it? The reality is that this stone is as much of an enigma as the rest of the site. Will we sort that out? Will we sort the site out? We'll know tomorrow. Hello, my name's John Gator. Time Team is fan-funded by Patreon. This vital support helps us to make new episodes. Joining Patreon gives you access to exclusive interviews, 3D models and masterclasses, plus lots more.